Today's video will go over the three most commonly used ones, FAT32, NTFS, and XFAT. FAT32 is an older file system that's not as efficient as NTFS, but offers greater compatibility. Its biggest flaw is its size limit. Each file can only be up to four gigabytes. The total limit capacity of the drive is two terabytes, so you can forget about any movies made with an HD camera. Its biggest advantage is its compatibility with the majority of products as televisions, multimedia devices, and gaming consoles all use FAT32. It's also compatible for writing and reading on a Windows or a Linux or even a Mac computer. NTFS, which is a Microsoft format, is the most modern file system and works with all versions of Windows. It far exceeds the size and capacity limits of the FAT32 and is compatible with some multimedia boxes and televisions, so check your product's technical specifications. It can also be read on a Mac, but writing on one is not all that possible. XFAT is a modern replacement for FAT32. More devices and operating systems support XFAT rather than NTFS. However, XFAT is not nearly as widespread as FAT32. XFAT has very large limits on files and partition sizes. It allows you to store files much larger than 4 gigs. XFAT is generally ideal for flash drives, and reading and writing works on computers and Macs, but isn't used on other devices. To format a USB flash drive, insert it into a USB port, and in the File Explorer, right-click on your flash drive. Select Format to see the list of configurations, including file system. Expand the options and click on the one you want, and then on Start. It's important to note that this process will erase anything that you have on your flash drive. If you're not sure that it's empty, cancel the process and check it. Once you are sure, click on OK to continue. When complete, click OK and close the format window. 